<laughs> okay. I'm doing all 50 chapters again of the book God dictated to me. Isaiah 53 and the day of the Lord. Just as he dictated the Torah to Moses as the Orthodox Jews believe. And uh, quite frankly, just as he dictated and commanded and directed all of the prophets to write their books, he's responsible for the entirety of the Hebrew Bible. And uh, we got videos talking about how you can see that that has to be. How some of these books just go together. It's just like the day of the Lord. How do you find it? Well, you got to have God's representation. So that's 11, Isaiah 11 and 53. Then Jeremiah 31 tells us a time is coming, a time is coming, a time is coming, and God will make a new covenant with you. Okay, well that time's here. The land blooms again, cities restored, Jerusalem rebuilt. Okay, it's here. Where's the covenant? There's only one place you can find that covenant. It's a covenant of sin forgiveness. And it's in Malachi 3, the last page, God speaks to his prophets and announces the day of the Lord. And that he's returning. The God of Israel, uh, this is called God Creates and He Forms. Chapter 13. The God of Israel has come to the earth to dwell with the Anointed One and the Jewish people in Israel as he once came to dwell with Moses and move about among the tents of the Israelites. He creates the man of Isaiah 53 as he created all humanity. And then he forms his righteous servant just as he created Jacob and formed Israel for his purpose, the Jewish people. He created the universe, the earth, and humanity, including Jacob and the man described in Isaiah 53. He then forms them for his purposes. He formed Israel with covenants in the names Hebrew, Israel, and Jew, and 613 laws that defined and refined the Jewish people in the oppression of the world. He formed his righteous servant in the fire of refinement with an oppressive judgment of maltreatment, chastisement, punishment, crushing, and bruising in Isaiah 53 a fire of refinement by the hand of God by his words and his powers, just as he did with Ezekiel. And you can also find it in Jonah, the book of Jonah, book of Job, but most particularly Ezekiel. And now you're finding out it's a big part of 53. God just doesn't use it by name. And he actually des describes it, defines it in Ezekiel. And that's not in 53 either the purpose of the fire of fire, and why he did all those horrible things to Ezekiel. Okay. That was 13. This is 14. I'm going to do them together. 14. Hebrew and Jew. A fugitive brought the news to Abram, the Hebrew, who was dwelling at the terebinth of Mamre, the Amorite, a kinsman of Eschol and Anna, these being Abraham's allies. allies. That's Genesis chapter 14, verse 13. No one is a Hebrew until a fugitive brought the news to Abram the Hebrew. It's never, it was never used. We don't know where it came from. In the fortress Shashan lived a Jew by the name of Mordecai, son of Jer, the son of Shemi, son of Kish, Benjamites, not Judaites, Benjamites, but Mordecai the Jew. No one is a Jew until Mordecai is described as a Jew. Mordecai the Jew is of the tribe of Benjamin, and his people are the Jews. The name seems to be a form of the word Judah. But the tribe of Judah and the lands allotted to Judah have nothing to do with the word Jew. 
It is a special word, just as Hebrew is a special word. Words from God for God. Remember, he dictated it. He said, write this down. And he just, he just put them in there. Just It's part of forming the Jewish people. These names identify God's chosen people throughout the world. Just as religious ritual, faith, and manner of dress identify them. God formed Israel in part to test the world and the people of Israel had to be identifiable. These names and 613 laws did just that and the world has failed. God changing the name Hebrew to the Jew may have more to do with the Jewish people being in exile. Mordecai was in exile than anything else. Shortening Hebrew to a Jew, they both end E.W. To account for marriage outside of the tribes, a dilution of the pure Hebrew blood. Okay, next up, the God of Elijah, chapter 15. 